Time to review our final expansion to the Formula D series. It's the New Jersey Sochi board. Uh, this one came out last year. This is New Jersey right now. And to be honest, these are the ones I haven't raced on that much. We haven't had time to play Formula D in quite some time. It's been a couple of months just because we are enjoying zombies. Uh, but these I have played, I have raced on these, oh, maybe twice or, or maybe three times. I can't remember. Uh, so these boards I can't talk much about because I just, you know, haven't played them as much. Uh, we do, oh, let me show you Sochi here. Oh, yeah, I remember Sochi. <laughs> Extremely fun. Uh, this one, uh, you can gather up a lot of speed up here, but you've got to slow down in that three turn. It is awful. Um, looking at the Sochi board, though, yes, I do remember this one. This is actually my favorite of the two. Uh, here. Uh, these games are a lot of fun. If, if you ever get them, you combine them all. What we wanted to do is something similar to like Zombageddon. Remember, all together, there's five, two each, that would make ten, plus the two they give you in the board. So that would make 12 racetracks. You could have an all-day Formula D race. It is so much fun. A lot points to first, second, third place. I think it'd be so much fun. We haven't done it like we've done Zombageddon annually, but we have talked about it and we want to. So hopefully soon we'll have something like that. And if we do, yeah, I'll let you know how it works. But it shouldn't be too bad. It would take all day to race all 12 tracks. But hey, that's what those hardcore gamers do, right? Folks, before I let you go, thank you so much for sharing the videos. Thank you so much for your subscriptions. Hey, you're the reason I do these reviews. And if, if any other board game news or if I get any others to review, I will definitely let you know right here. Appreciate you.